Rwanda's President Paul Kagame is present at the forum and he arrived with a high-level uh, delegation. Jean Dudieu is Rwanda's new ICT minister and he joins us in Davos now. Very welcome to the show, sir. Now, already Rwanda's drone technology advancements have featured uh, on the first day of the World Economic Forum. You, of course, are the first country to adopt performance-based drone regulation. So tell us a little bit about the reception uh, you have received at the World Economic Forum so far. Uh, yesterday, we announced uh, the adoption of policy of performance-based uh, policy uh, and standard regulations uh, to drones. We are very excited uh, to have. Uh, that uh, kind of advanced uh, policies to guide the drone industry uh, in Rwanda. We have already had uh, a number of drone players and applications in various sectors, but we also needed uh, an enhanced uh, standard and policies uh, to guide how the industry is growing. Uh, here in Davos, uh, many people are interested to learn about the new regulation or the, the enhanced regulation, and we are willing uh, to share the outcome and benefits of those regulations. Right. And of course, uh, Minister, a big part of the discussion at the World Economic Forum is easing into that fourth industrial revolution. And we do know that Rwanda has been aggressive about improving its competitiveness. So what are Rwanda's contributions to that discussion uh, at the forum? Uh, yes, Rwanda is adopting uh, in technology as uh, part of the fourth industrial revolution, our contribution is uh, to opening up uh, for anyone who wants to learn from our experience. Uh, drone is one uh, among many other technology we are looking forward to implementing. Uh, cut. Mm. Well, Minister, many thanks for joining us. Unfortunately, we do have to end it there. Of course, that was the Rwanda's ICT Minister Jean de Dieu joining us in Davos.